Alright guys, today we're going to be talking about a subject that will help you see the Bible much deeper and look for the deeper spiritual truths and understandings. The word is understandings of the Bible. So sometimes you'll run into things that look like they're contradicting each other, but you have to think deeper, you have to think spiritual. That's why Paul says, consider what I say and the Lord give the understanding in all things. Paul is un uh, unveiling, revealing the deeper spiritual truths and natures of the Word of God. So let me show you what I mean. Exodus chapter 33, uh, we're going to start at verse 20. We'll just read verse 20. And he said, this is God speaking, Thou canst not see my face, for there shall no man see me and live. Okay, that's pretty cut and dry clear. Now, we would have a contradiction, it would seem, in Genesis chapter 32. And I'm going to start at verse 24. And Jacob was left alone, and there wrestled a man with him until the breaking of the day. So Jacob's wrestling with the man, okay? Who is this? And when he saw that he prevailed not against him, he touched the hollow of his thigh. And the hollow of Jacob's thigh was out of joint as he wrestled, keep that in mind, wrestled with him. And he said, Let me go, for the day breaketh. And he said, I will not let thee go, except thou bless me. And he said unto him, What is thy name? And he said, Jacob. And he said, Thy name shall be called no more Jacob, but Israel. For as a prince hast thou power with God and with men, and hath prevailed. And Jacob asked and said, Tell me, I pray thee, thy name. And he said, Wherefore is it that thou dost ask after my name? And he blessed him there. And Jacob called the name of the place Peniel. This is another key thing to remember. For I have seen God face to face, and my life is preserved. So how can the Bible say that Jacob saw God face to face? And in Exodus 33, it says, God says, no man can see me face to face, or he'll die. Well, the answer is spiritual. That's why Paul's gospel is important to, to examine. He's giving you the deeper spiritual things and understandings. Watch. I'm going to answer this question for you. Go to Ephesians. Chapter 6. And verse 12. Ephesians chapter 6 and verse 12 is going to give you the answer on how these two things are possible at the same time. For we wrestle, remember Jacob was wrestling, not against flesh and blood. Jacob wasn't wrestling in the physical, guys. But against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Jacob was wrestling with God in the spirit. That's why in the spirit, he can see God face to face and not die. Because in the flesh, you cannot see God face to face, or you would die, you would be burned up, because the Bible says that God is a consuming fire. <coughs> That's how both can be true. Now, another key thing to remember is the place that Jacob wrestled with God at, he named Peniel. Well, where do we get the word pineal from? The pineal gland the third eye that is there in every single person and human being and that is our connector to the spiritual realm that's why god tells us don't do all these hallucinogenic drugs and witchcraft and stuff because when you do that you open yourself up to the spiritual realm and there's fallen angels and demons the devils they're they're there too not only god so you're not supposed to play with it but it is there for a reason just like a lot of things in this world. 
there are things in this world that we, if we do, um, that are there, but if abused, then it can hurt us, right? Wine, for some people, is okay every now and then for the blood and for the heart. Good wine. But not for people who have been alcoholics. But if you abuse the wine, then it becomes a bad thing. Just like our pineal gland. We're not to try to stimulate it with DMT, ayahuasca, any mind-altering drug, LSD. It's there for a purpose. But if you abuse that purpose with all these things, you open yourself up to the demonic realm. So as you can see there, I wanted to show you guys that, how somebody... How Jacob wrestled with God and seen his face. And then the Bible says that no man can see God's face or he'll die. It's because Jacob was wrestling with God in the spiritual. And he named the place Pineal. Bible's too cool.